Philippines right now. I'm scared. But, um, <laughs> but anyways, uh, Netflix gave me a call. He said, hey, would you like to show run um, this show? And uh, I, I was like, it's, you know, it's based on Filipino mythology. It's, it's kind of like shit. a procedural. And I thought, oh, that's cool. Am I getting this because I'm Filipino? Because I've never gotten a job that. because I'm Filipino. <laughs> Uh, but apparently, you know, I mean, my movies have done well on their Maybe streaming service and whatnot. So um, they, they, um, they contacted me. So we, we, we did wow, um, oh, the first <clears throat> season where we just finished it. It's going to be sure. coming out uh, this year. Uh, we're going to be announcing the, the date soon. Oh, we just okay. did the first cast announcement oh, okay. of Liza okay. Soberano and Shay Mitchell for our lead. <clears throat> um, but it's cool. I mean, it's, it's set in Manila. It's set in the Philippines. It's, it's, it's kind of like my love letter to all the stories that my parents had told me growing up about, you know, you know, Filipino spirits and, and like kind of like supernatural things. And, it, you know, in the Philippines, they don't they don't pull back on on the kind of like fairy tales like they're, th those those mythological beings or, or creatures like they'll straight up murder you in your, sleep, in your in your sleep. Like there's no yeah. like, hey, you know, they're, they're going to grant wishes. No, it's 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 pretty it's hardcore. Hard. So um, so anyways, uh, so we did that. It's you know, I did this. You know, this is the first thing that I did for my for my studio. And uh, it looks great. I mean, it's based on a comic book. And, you know, like, uh, you know, the fans out there should check it out. Uh, like I said, I'll be, I'll be, okay. I'll be doing some press about this for the next, um, for the next couple right. of months. Oh, I'm uh, dying. Uh, leading up to when it eventually comes out, and uh, yeah, so I hope you guys check it out. I'll do a bunch more. I'll probably do some more like interviews and podcasts once once I get the green light so from Netflix and kind of start really, like, promoting it. But I think it's something that's very near and dear, and I think for all the fans who like uh, trailer, maybe? who like me, I think you should watch it because <laughs> I think it's cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's awesome. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward. I love, I love the art I'm style. Excited. Oh my gosh! Thanks, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. One of the things we wanted to do is even the incidental characters, we tried to make them look Filipino a little bit, so they look a little so, Asian. Um, okay. So, uh, but yeah, and also we we, we took a lot of um, kind of like uh, and in, death, in Manila. We give uh, glory. Kind of set, set a lot of the sequences uh, there. So hello. That way, if you're walking around, you'd be like, hey, wait a minute. You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. You know, where the characters got attacked by Aswan. The and Aswans are the okay, hey, their version can you of hear me? So, um, but yeah, it's so you. We, we did, I think, what the we did. The child's father. Yeah, my, my small child? Team would, hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? <gasps> Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose! Yeah. Right. Well, uh, she is in great danger. Say that we're, you know, Since Mother Miranda, Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into the, darkness. The, uh, what are you talking about? The, dead stuff, the monsters? So that, right. The animated project I'm doing with Zach. Um, we are the in production on that. Uh, it looks fantastic. Give me a gun. They're uh, coming. They haven't, <laughs> like, they, they haven't no. told me what Wait. I can Wait, yeah. where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell awesome. tolls for us all. It's come out soon. Oh, no. They're it. coming all I can say. again. Uh, uh, but it's been great. It's been great working with Zach. Uh, you know, Zach had done um, Guardians, right? So he had done the, the feature animation. But feature animation is very different than TV animation. So this was a really interesting thing to work with Zach on because in this one, I knew a lot more oh, than no. Zach in, a, in some ways, oh, no. you know, because and I'm used to TV is where I come from, right? Whereas if please. I do feature, a lot of times I'm just, I just kind of learning and, and watching, you know, from Zach. So this is one of those ones where I had to, I, you know, I talked to him, but Zach was able to pick it up. He's like, okay, cool. So he knew exactly, and you know, and he's, I, I think he's having a good hey, time, time like we're doing the records with all the actors and, like, you know, approving artwork and going over you know, the storyboards oh, and stuff okay. and the design. So I think um, he's having yeah. a lot of fun because it's almost like he's making a movie, but not really having Ooh. to like shoot it, like mm -hmm. and have to like be on location for like 18 months or something like something right. crazy. And so it's. I think, he's, I think he's having a good time. I don't know, but I, I think so. I've been able to convince him to do two of these with me, so so that's good. Oh, my God. That's <laughs> yeah, I mean, I was looking at the voice cast. Okay. It's phenomenal who you've got. Um, okay. You've got Christian Slater, Joe Manganiello, Harry Lennox, uh, Ross Butler, Vanessa Hudgens, uh, Christina Wren. Yeah, so yeah, just a, uh, a whole bunch of so great him. names. I heard Ray Porter uh, mentioned earlier, but uh, he wasn't on the list of uh, who was announced, so I don't know if that was a slip up or not. But oh yeah, I think Ray's. I mean, it's like what Zach mentioned earlier. Like usually when he has a project, oh he gosh, goes I remember, to um, family, right? He usually right. goes to <laughs> the, one, the boss, cast. one of the bosses. And uh, right so when we were casting, whenever we were stuck or or um, when there was a part that Zach's Wait. like, you know what? I think this guy could do it perfectly, and we're like. And we're like, do you think he would do it? And Zach's like, let me give him a call. And then Zach would just, let's just call him. And I was like, how cool is that? You just have these actors on speed dial. Like, 
like normally you have to go through their agents or managers yeah. it's you know, just back and forth but i think it's really cool like you know because again I, everybody loves working with zach i mean that's the one thing i can't stress enough everybody yeah. loves working with zach the attention. actors the scripts the, everybody mm -hmm. on crew so whenever like zach gives you a call you're more than happy to drop it help out i mean that that was the one thing that i learned when i, left, when I was working on bgs with zach in detroit because remember um i was on i was man of steel in chicago for about three months but then when i went to be went to detroit for eight months i saw a lot of the same guys right the same crew and yeah. and, and you know i just you know you, you, i have a lot of lunches with them just hanging out and i and they're always like yeah you know love working with zach some of them have been working with zach since dawn of the dead right or <laughs> And, and or even earlier than that and they're yeah. like and they're like whenever zach calls we just we always you know, if we can make it we, we try to do anything we can to work with him and, yeah. and that was like the second film and that's when i was like wow come on this is why people love working with zach and, and how like infectious it is to work with him because he's, you know, he's kind of like me he gets super excited about you know talking about different projects and ideas and stuff he's very passionate about it and and you want to work on it you want to have you want to have somebody who's at the helm who is very passionate yeah. about the project, the story, yeah. you know, the characters, mm -hmm. or whatever. And, because it just makes it easier, right? Because then, when you know, when I come to work, I feel like I'm just collaborating. I'm just helping out. I'm helping. I'm helping the chef make this beautiful meal, right? And and I get to eat a little bit of it because it's it's this amazing meal. And, and that's kind of like yeah. working with. It's kind of like that where like I'm always thankful any kind of opportunity I get to kind of collaborate with. Him. And I'm constantly learning from him. You know, there are a few things where. Like I'll even talk to him sometimes. Like, so how do you work with you know different actors and uh, you know uh, you know in case like you know, one is more difficult than the other or one you know like because some actors you know they they, they don't want to take direction and some do and and it's really interesting like you know he'll he'll tell me like you know tips and stuff that he's done over the years that he's tried and whatnot and it and it's great. You know? I mean these are, these are things that I love me? talking shop with actors like him and Ben Patrick and even Rick you know, talking about like so how do you do this when you guys are on yeah. set. Uh, and, and to me, it's fun because it, again, it's, it's talking shop because it's it's a part of directing that I don't <sighs> normally do because I'm norm normally just doing animated stuff. But if I ever do live action, which I hopefully I love to do, yeah, I'll, I'll already kind of know because I've, again, I've gotten a lot of tips from people like Zach. I hear people, but I don't see people. Hey, you know what? This, this kind of works. Or hey, if you have trouble oh, doing this, use this lens or do that. You know, like, oh, uh, that's bad. Oh my god. So it looked like we had a question four, asking if uh, Trisse means thirteen. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, uh, you'll, you'll, you'll find out in the series, but, uh, but yes, you should definitely see it. So the main character, is her name is Alexandra Tressing, so it's her last name. But there are, there is a lot of, like, I'm lost. To it. I'm yeah. lost. But if you're a fan of, like, you know, uh, supernatural, occult, action, adventure, even a little bit of superhero stuff, it's, it's very, I would say it's like my Justice League guard in a lot of ways. There's a lot of uh, magic and monsters. Right. Also Guess this leads to the castle. That's cool. It's, it's a fun thing. And I can't. I can't stress enough how proud I am of. Come on, put it in there. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. Yep, sign me up. I, I think that's a sent sentiment for all of us. <laughs> I think we're all interested in this. So. I didn't send this. That had to be Meg or Cole. <laughs> oh, somebody else doing it. <laughs> <laughs> no, because it came from Justice Con account. Oh. So. oh, did it? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Random messages are popping up. Well, uh, I, I, is there anything else you all wanted to ask me? I'm sure they're gonna ask me about like something about Ben Affleck's script or something like that. <laughs> you usually that was, don't answer that, that but if you've got anything you're willing to say about it, we're we're all ears. <laughs> I hope they make it. I, 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 yeah. I, I had done a really amazing fight and fight sequence for that that I think I'm only a handful something. of people have seen. Um, yeah. That's it. But I can't share it, unfortunately. Well, I mean, Joe Manganiello has been talking about a, a fight sequence with, um, I don't know if it was the end fight sequence, but it involved, you know, Batman no. with Batgirl and Bruce and, Death 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 and like... that they end up losing. So. Yeah, there, there is, uh, yeah, Batgirl was in it. There was some cool stuff. Yeah, I wish Joe can say this stuff. I can't. <laughs> you I'm can't. Just lowly, I'm just a lowly it's... artist on the production, so I can't really say too much about it other than the fact that I yeah. thought it was. Thought it was just yeah, Joe, there, Joe talked about it, it a bit today, yeah. Although, like, I think some of the stuff that Joe was saying might have been in the later scripts than I worked on, because yeah. the stuff that I worked on um, is a little bit of difference. Um, but, 
like I said, uh, that early version I, for me was, was really good, and I, mm -hmm. I hope something of it because it was, it, was, it was fun. I don't know if Zach read that one, but I thought it was cool. That was really good. Yeah, I think all of us in the fan community, it's a no-brainer. <laughs> we all want to see it. That, and again, I would have to say this too, is that like I really wish um, uh, Rick was able to do his Flash film. Because Rick, he was Flash from with it. Which really I know. Good. That was really good. And Rick was an amazing, was an amazing director to work with. And um, I was really looking forward to that. I loved his film Dope, which I just yeah. thought was oh, fantastic. Oh, fantastic! Yeah, it's great. Yeah. Nice yeah. So yeah. good. Yeah. And the stuff wanted, in it, yeah. yeah, the stuff he wanted to do in, uh, in, yes. in his Flash film was, was really good. Mm -hmm. And that was the one that I was working on. I actually worked a lot a on it because uh, that, was the, that was the one that I had first started with um, before I got oh, wrangled yeah. into working with Ben on his and then and ultimately working on Justice League with Zach and then doing reshoots. But I, yeah, so I, I was on a I good like, six shit. months um, on, on Rick stuff before they actually worked on it. It was a shame. I was ready to back, go back to London because I was going to go back to London for another like a couple months, and I was like, "Cool, oh, oh, shit, shit. And chips and, and hit the pubs there." But, uh, yeah. I was, I was really oh, God. 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 I'm hoping. David Ayer's Suicide Squad. So you know, I'm trying to make some kind of Version. I love to say I didn't work on it, but so I can't comment too much on it. Other than, you know, oh God, David follows me on Twitter, but I've never really talked to him. But I'd love to, if I ever did talk to him, I'd be like, why didn't you hire me to work on Suicide Squad? Like, you know I did the answer. You could have hired me. Uh, Vance, but it's get a, the campaign uh, going. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> but, but I love, again, I'm one of the things Come I'd on. love to do. I'd love to do. Uh, uh, so we'll see. I mean, that, 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 that might be something that we next we'll see. Uh, or who knows? Maybe they'll give David another uh, DC film to do. Hey, I would love yeah. to see. what are you doing here? Or Zach? I'd like to see Zach do another one. We'll see. We'll see if yep. Zach wants to do another one. Yeah. Stay back. Please. Absolutely. Don't hurt us. Whoa. Uh, is, it's okay. is there anything else you want to talk about? I'm not gonna Otherwise, hurt you. Uh, we can I'm just let glad you to see normal people at last. To your IMDb Have you seen any other survivors? Spent almost two hours here. No. <laughs> oh, is it oh my god. They're all in Louise's house. house. I hope I and she's not answering so in the game. No, we love locked. it. No, oh absolutely. God. We let you go another I, hour. I can for hours. Usually when I my class. It's all lecture, yeah. but I end up going oh. off on tangents and talking about like experiences on the Shit, we're sitting ducks in here. Can your old man walk? I'm like, oh wait, I gotta get back to the lecture. No. Um, <laughs> One of the uh, monsters well, cut you. Know, so, you know, He's got, lost we got a lot of blood. We have to get out. into Louise's house. Um, Quiet. I'm also show running, uh, co show running. Must be a way inside. Well studio doing uh, Stay art, here. Um, video game. Be quiet. Yeah. Doing Don't move until I get those gates open. Um, with an amazing cast like Russell Crowe and uh, Jeffrey Wright and Ella uh, Cage, and it's, it's pretty nuts. So I don't know when that's coming out, but it's going to come out soon. There's a trailer you can check out on YouTube. Just look up Arc Animated Series. Uh, you'll see that there. Um, we did my studio did the, that trailer, um, but it looks fantastic, and we're working with like oh. some amazing actors oh, around the world. We were fortunate because of the pandemic, <clears throat> that all the actors were working from home or just at home because uh, there was no live. You know, there were uh, there, nobody was shooting. So whenever we reached out to them, they're like, I'm just sitting at home. Sure, right? <laughs> so we were able to get like an amazing cast that I, I thought. We did Malcolm McDowell. I mean, <gasps> it's amazing the kind of people that we were able to get. Um, Gerard Butler's in it as well, and Michelle Yeoh. Yeah, mm. I could go on. But that's another thing you guys should keep an eye out. Um, on Twitter, I usually try to post up stuff that I'm going to promote. Uh, I usually don't do podcasts or interviews, but I'm going to start kind of doing it the next, you know, next probably week coming up the year because I got a bunch of stuff I got to promote. Yeah. Uh, I might have some stuff at Comic-Con maybe uh, that okay. I'll be promoting. So if you guys want to check that out, I think uh, check it out, help support it. And um, I think that's about it. And then hopefully there'll be a Justice Con 3. And then I, I can, maybe I'll, maybe in the Justice Con 3, I'll show some of my storyboards uh, that I did for, uh, for uh, Zack Snyder's um, Justice League as well oh. as. Um, Come on, it's there's clear. There's some stuff on BVS that never hurry, made it that I think hurry. you guys would be would love to see. Like, so I did a lot of the Superman saving the world. So the one where he's got the damn. rocket and yeah. pulling oh, the ship. And I did all that stuff. But we, but Zach uh, one time just said, they just come with a bunch of Superman saving people. So I, yeah. I have a ton of other he's stuff. He's not that used done to relying on other people. The film, but it was all I'm kind sorry. of iconic. Different things of Superman saving We'll be people, safe in here. Uh, from the comics we? that I was thought. Oh, that'd be safer here than out there, that's for sure. Maybe I'll show that next hey, 
Who, who, uh, Do you know anything who about what's going on around here? Are you able to release him? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I can release Mother it, but Miranda I mean, at this point, remember, at this point, like, um, they never really used it, so I, I guess it like, Father? falls oh, into... Dude. I can kind of show it. I mean, I just can't sell it. We have it to get inside. It, but I can. Yeah. There's no reason why I can't say, look at this. Whoa. You know, and, Anybody um, home? I can always say it's fan art. Maybe I can say it's just me home. drawing Superman. <laughs> <laughs> Louisa, <laughs> open up. It's me, Elena. But, uh, but yeah, we, I did a bunch of stuff like for that on uh, awesome. Batman. Stop, Stop shouting. I did a bunch You'll of, draw the monsters. Really Who's this? A friend. Stay back. <laughs> Chasing after Father. Them. For God's sake, Julian, let us in. No, no, they'll smell the blood. You'll endanger us all. My father will die out here. That's oh, yeah. not my problem. So What's going on? These people want to let a dying man into our home. Come now, these people are our friends. Go on, go in. This <laughs> Can't the CG stuntman do it? And they're like, no. You're not from I had one time I had Batman. Uh, he like jumped no. and his cape flared up and he glided. Because I mean, I do Julian, that all the time. Julian, don't make yourself. Yeah, the cape doesn't do that. I'm like, it doesn't. I He's said, like, yeah, we don't do it. I'm like, I was like, we should really do that because it's a Batman. But exactly. Yeah. I was like, okay, that's fine. Uh, I mean, Philander, one of the things I think I mentioned this last time. Uh, this is maybe one of the last things I'll mention. You'll, Come inside. If you yeah. watch any of the DC animated stuff, whether it's a TV show or, or, mm -hmm. or, um, or one of the or one of the films. Here, I'll check um, on the others. If you ever see Batman throwing batarangs that explode, it's usually me. <laughs> Yeah. I do that. I'm. I'm like. If I'm Batman, I'm throwing batarangs. I'm gonna make them. I'm gonna explode. Like, if I'm gonna be putting like my utility belt, and it's like, okay, here's a batarang that knocks people out, and here's one that explodes. I'm gonna. I'm gonna stock up on the ones that explode. So if you ever watch that, that's what I try to do. So I was doing. I try to do that with BVS, and I don't think I was able to get any out there. Maybe they do it with um, Doomsday fight when he fights Doomsday, but I didn't work on the Doomsday fight. Mm -hmm. But I, I'm always trying to do having Batman like blow people up with, with his grenade batarangs. That's that's one of my signature things. And then like with Superman, what did I do with Superman? I like to do heat vision and punch at the same time, but I know it's kind of mm -hmm. hard because you're punching your eyes are kind yeah. of doing this. <laughs> right. In animation, I could just draw Come Superman's inside, the head straight waiting. and just have him doing this and it works. Yeah. Like, what the fuck is this? But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I, 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 and I hope you guys, you guys he helped do, Leonardo um, and Elena. Another Justice League fan. Uh, Justice Cons. Please invite me back. I think you kind of set us up for that because they will not let it go now. Is this all that's left? The entire village? And for those of you like, be sure to donate to Suicide Awareness because that's it. There is no one left! A worthless invalid! Help everybody out, you know. Uh, we really live in a crazy bitch. time now, and, and you we're very fortunate to get you the Snyder Cut. You drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing. I didn't do it. All I, I did was come to be in all safe. and just troll the there trolls. There is no safe. Yeah. Because you're, little, you're a troll. <laughs> Sorry, bastard out there. No, in it's half. one of those things where, like, I, I'm in a unique Sorry. position because I work on both Marvel and the DC universe, yeah. so you can't just say like, "Oh, you're just a DC guy." I work on everything, but. Just you know, like plus a damn husband. Unique, you know, kind of Put a sock in it, Roxanne. That's enough. I did work on all this stuff. This so, house so when people say has that protected my family exist, for generations. Or, you know, and drunk or not, you are all this, welcome like, I'm more than and happy safe in here. And say, okay, here. number one, you're making this up, right? Like, don't talk out of your butt because clearly Someone please you don't know. What the right? hell is going on here? We don't I'm know. Right your best. One yeah. day we and were then, quiet, like, devout, like, village, I'm just and trying the to next, because I don't want people, the monsters the thing is that there's a lot of misinformation out there, right? I, there I, was, just, yeah. I was looking at Twitter they, earlier, and there's they they still some stuff that's out Louisa. there that people are, are just kind husband? of guessing on, on you know, what, they, what no. happened for both this no, film no, and he, the other film. out there. And I'm just like, you guys don't know. And a lot of times it's a lot more complicated than what you think it is. And it's just a matter of just, yes, fans, it's just like, just support the things you like, right? And, you know, if... If, for example, like, let's say let you don't like a particular show that comes out, that's okay. Yeah. Just don't watch it. You don't have to, All like, of us. you know, you know, Good uh, idea. You don't have to, like, tell the fans Come. that they suck because they like it. Okay. Just don't Get watch it. It's fine. But at the same time, like, the thing is, is that if you support, you know, these kind of oh, DC yeah. films or oh, DC, awesome. Marvel, whatever, it just means that you're going to get more of the same, right? You'll, I mean, you'll Great get ones. more of these kind Here of stories. Right? Like, if, if, if comic book films and, and TV series weren't we successful, on then they'd stop. Within the endless dark. Right to now, deliver us into fate's hands I, 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 as I the midnight it. moon rises on black wings so we so make our sacrifice and animation as well as live action and, and like I mentioned earlier in life 
with the and Ben, 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 and ben Affleck. We give you glory. Different versions of Batman. Out Mother there. Miranda. And there's no reason. All the only thing that the studios respond no. to is just the teacher money. Be ready. Uh, they respond to come help me, you know, Elaine, People please. getting subscriptions. People like that prayer. saying what they I've want. I've heard it before. For the longest there was an old time, woman near the graveyard. There was a, uh, vocal minority of <laughs> critics who were who were uh, trashing Zach's oh, films and saying that crazy it's crazy. It's, 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 there is wisdom like, in her it's, devotion. It's, though. It may not be your cup of tea, and I hope he cool, protected her. But as it shall there are a lot of people us. who really like this stuff. I'm one of them. I, mean, I like my I like my <laughs> different ways, right? I mean, so I like them all. So what are you no doing, Leonardo? Did the right thing. Again, Elena, Elena, no. There's nothing you can do. This entire place is collapsing. And the studio's kind of really uh look at You couldn't save him. He was already gone. Online and kind of Leave me alone. Around, no. You know, the We're getting out of here. I think things are Together. Be, uh, things are be, and we are seeing things. Right? Um, hopefully it's for the better. I mean, I'm just a cog in the wheel. When people tell me, like, Jay, why don't you do this? I'm like, I can't pitch that stuff. I don't own these characters. Right. I, I, don't, I have to wait until they call me and say, hey, Jay, do you want to work on this? Cool. I mean, but I, I think, like I said, like, right now is a, it's a fun time to be a fan. But at the same time, we have to be really cognizant of the kind of like uh, responsibility we have to to each other, like oh, not shit. to yeah. blame everybody, Should right? I mean, like I said, Marvel and DC, it's all good, right? Be heard, but, but be is, heard like, respectfully, respectfully, right? Yeah, we live in a time that like it's it's yep. it's, it's, it's really great to be a comic book, right? And you don't have to be a fan of a comic book. Right? People always Batman shirts, Superman shirts. Captain America shirts. Before in the old days, you had to be, yeah, hide that stuff, right? Okay. Now it's like, it's everybody's got it. Yeah. yeah, and now it's a fun thing. I mean, that's why I got all this geek stuff behind me, and I get to work on all these cool projects. Um, that's awesome. that's and, and if you want to do what I'm doing, all it really takes is just, you know, it's a lot of hard work. Just do it's it. It's a lot of like, and just do it, right? I mean, there's a lot. Of, there's a lot of people out there who oh. think. Oh, you know, I'm uh, I'm not talented enough, See, or it's all luck. It is luck, but at the same time, if you really put the time in and, and work on your craft, whether it's drawing or directing or acting or whatever you want to do, you can do anything. I mean, you can yeah. accomplish because I mean, look at me. I mean, I was I, I was gonna tell I was gonna tell this story. I, I hope this isn't too long. The fire's moving story. fast. Yeah. So when no, I was a, take your time. When I was a kid, I. I used to go to Comics Unlimited, which was in uh, Hawaiian Gardens. Like, I grew up in Orange County. I used to bike there. What it was like thinking? a 30 minute Step back. bike ride. Would and it was in, like, in, in an area of town that was really oh, not that great. But as a kid, I didn't care. <laughs> I, I'd bike there. So I'd bike there every week. And I remember one time, and this changed my life, uh, John Romeo Sr. was there. And he was looking at me. Different artists. Like, he'd say, hey, you want John Romeo Sr. to look at your stuff? And I went there, I got his signature, I loved his stuff, and I <laughs> He was the first professional to do that. He gave me all his crap. Are you alright? The words he told me. Let me back up again. Basically there isn't any time. Uh inspired me to think go into art and uh and he was a really nice man and again I don't know whether or not he was just being nice, but the words he told me always stuck with me. Rabbi, and, hurry! And that led me. That's why, I, like, I was just thinking about it today. That that was the first comic book creator, Let's or, move. or professional who actually really critiqued, looked so at my work and said, "Try not to breathe in the smoke." 
might have I know. A, might have a, Thank you, Ethan. A future doing this, and I, I remember Hi. it inspired me. I just went back home and I just kept drawing. I and hope drawing your family is safe. I was young. I, I, I do. Been, like, maybe, like, <gasps> and, Come uh, on. But that's It'll what I mean. Is that like you know, for those people who want to end up doing what I'm doing? Uh, it, there. That's don't, our way don't out. Don't be afraid to, Thank God. You know, to get criticism. And you're, most of the time, people are going to tell you that. The village is so full of monsters. My whole family told me that I We can't fight right? them. Well, There's too hard. many. Hey, hey, uh, hey don't and I talk said, like I'll that. show you, right? I was like, no. We'll find a safe house to put you in until I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. And again, again, I look at my The place is full of nothing but blood and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're. I haven't worked on Star Wars Father? yet, so hopefully I come to work on Star Wars, but I worked Elena, on a no. lot of things that I That's not him! Kid not anymore! Up, <laughs> he said my name! Father! Wait, it's not safe! No. Stay there! Stay the course, and what you say, Come on! You Give me your hand! Lead on you, just, you know, work on yourself, and, and then the, it'll eventually... Ethan, go! Save your daughter! Elena, don't give up! Reach for me! God damn it! I saw the... I saw the, the poster you guys did, right? And of today, and like there's all these people Why on there. I'm like, holy shit, and then there's me, on me, like, on there. <laughs> I was, I was, uh, I was, I was, I think I tweeted it, this and I remember tweeting and looking at the poster going, okay, of all the people here, who does not belong? <laughs> and I was like, yeah, I shouldn't, <laughs> I shouldn't be in that, be in that thing, and, and, uh, it's, I don't get it. again, it was one of those things where it's, it's, it's I'm very, again, I'm, I'm very humbled by the fact that I could be part of the panels, uh, some, be, yeah, again, and be the last one, right, I mean, yeah. because I know I ramble a lot more than Zach does, but, uh, but uh, you know, to me, it, it really meant a lot for to me. Why the fuck is this happening again? I can just ramble as long as I of want. Of course. To. <laughs> Shit. So, thank you again, and and it still freaks me out that I'm in that I'm in that poster with all those other guys because I, I no, feel no, like you... I just photoshopped myself myself in there and be like, guys, look, I'm on this thing with Zack Snyder and Ray, you know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you will always have a home at Justice Con. Um, thank before you. we let you close it out and let you go. Um, Liz, shout out to Liz Wonder. She actually reminded me of a question I wanted to tell nice. Tim to ask you, but I'll ask you myself. Okay. Um, so it was, it was spotted in ZSJL, some members of the Newton Gang. And was that something that you did? Who's there? No, I wish I had done it, but it is. It is Gang. I think. Um, I mean, Zach always has a love for Frank Miller's Dark Knight Returns, so. It, I thought I thought it was a fun Easter egg for him to throw that in. Who was no, that? I, I didn't. I wish what I had. Was that? Although I'm glad that Zach did it, because if I if I had pitched it, I would have felt like I was a little bit like tooting my own horn. Like, hey, Zach, yeah, I can understand but, that. But no, I didn't. Unfortunately, I didn't. I didn't. I, didn't do that. I wish I. Say I did. that had to have been a surprise for you, right? Oh yeah, it was. I mean, yeah. I remember. I think it had leaked on the internet or something. It was on one of the early trailers, and I was like, "Hey, that's a bat tank." And then I, and then like, and then like if you look, there's one of the guys and he's got that visor, and I'm like, "Oh, that is so cool." So, I mean, yeah. Okay, here's, uh, here's a here's a fun story. I remember we were doing. Um, so this was on um, Batman v Superman. Um, well, there, yeah. there's a scene where uh, KG yes. Beast has Lois and he's got the flamethrower and then Batman comes all. to the wall and he, yeah. he grabs the gun and shoots him. Also known as the best scene in the movie. Yeah, yeah so, so I remember yes. Zach called me into his office and he's like, hey Jay. I'm like, what, Zach? He's like, uh, how did you do the, that Batman coming through the wall thing in, in your movie? I was like, <laughs> You mean in, in Dark Knight Returns? It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like when he grabs him and he shoots him. And I'm like, you do know, Zach, that they, they that's the same thing that's in Robocop, too. They did it in Robocop as well. And, and so I kind of like, we, we talked through it. And he's like, okay, what are we going to do with this one? And I'm like, well, we could try this. And then, and then so again, you see that. But it was just really fun that he called me and asked me because there was that homage Nothing to, but to blood that and death. in BBS. Huh? And just us talking, he's like, how did you do it? Okay, now how can we do something oh, different? Or how do we get this? And I was just like, dude, I was just ripping off Robocop. Robocop. It's, it's <laughs> <laughs> oh my god oh, that's absolutely amazing i love that but there's always fun i mean working with zach there's always fun times where like just randomly he'll ask me stuff like that you know i remember i gave him a copy of just sleep war um when we were doing that and i had again i had just finished uh, I, I it hadn't come out yet and i had a 
Death. And Lord, I had a director Lord, cut Miranda. and I gave it to him. <laughs> and he watched it over the weekend. And I remember on Monday, I was like, so what do you think? And he's like, he gave it to me. He's like, man, it's crazy. And that's all he said. He just said it was just crazy. And I was just like, is that good or bad? I don't know. What does that mean? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and next thing you know, in ZS, if he's life. close to yeah, referencing um, it, like yeah. almost yeah. there. Well, the whole Cyborg story. And everything. Yeah, yeah. I mean, everything. I mean, I can't.